action filled, somewhat exciting. Um, just fighting back and winning such an important game. Uh, what's your sense of just the battle level of this club? Well, the battle level, it wasn't clean. We, we looked like a team that was on the end of a long road trip at the start. We got some juice in the second period and, and then a couple of breaks in the third. Both teams missed empty nets in the third and uh, overall the, the juice we got in the second period allowed us so we stayed with it. I thought our goalie when it was 3-1 held us together and and then when we started to we started to create some cycle game in the second like towards the end of the second we felt a lot more comfortable in our game but today was exactly what it was. It was a gutsy win. It was a you know a never a never say die type of effort again. We've got in a lot of that right now and we just got to stay with it. How much do you thank your lucky stars on the post and what Pominville, you know, double hitting the puck that way? And yeah, well, the, those things even out. Like, like, yeah, we got a break, but we've we've had we've had unbelievable, unfortunate things happen to us in Montreal and in Philadelphia, where we could have walked out with two points there. So, those things equal out. I, I, I'm I'm just uh, proud of our guys the way we we responded. We didn't uh, we didn't go put our second foot on the bus. We, we dug in and played and competed, and it's a good sign for, for the team for now and good sign for moving forward, real good sign for moving forward. Ken, you, you guys close out this road trip 3-1-1. One, one. Uh, how does this set you guys up for the final 16 games with 10 games being at home ice? Uh, it, what it sets us up with is we're going to have to win our home games and play better at home than we've ever played this year if we expect to get in. But we've given ourselves a chance, but we're going to have to go and earn it. They're not going to give us points at home. We, we, we quite frankly have to play better at, at home uh, than we have all year uh, if we expect to do it. But no, now we've opened a door for ourselves and we just want to keep playing. I think that we've played much better on the road lately uh, than we have at home. And we're going to have to go and take some of the stuff we've been doing on the road into our home games. You said that you're sort of basing that on, on, on your checking style and your equipment. Is that a, a harder thing to do at home to convince players? Well, I think you become impatient. I think when you don't have success right away, we, we've shown impatience. We, we haven't stuck with it. You know, we've, we've tried to crack it open and, and paid for it because of that. We've got into the trading chances game, whereas we stay with it on the road. You know, we, we understand what we've got, we understand who we are, and we're willing to stay with it, whereas at home we... We get impatient and we want to strike right away. So if we can bring some of that patience off the road back home and keep working like we are and keep having the good spirit we got going, you never know. And you're talking about uh, Leon Dreisaitl's defensive play and, and his positioning this morning. What did you think about that pass he made to uh, Darnell Nurse? On the well, it's not surprising, but we we had some people that were struggling and we needed Connor and uh, Darnell to, or sorry, and, and Leon to run lines. We needed those guys to run the lines, and and they both did a great job today. You know, they they needed to carry some people. Other guys were struggling, and um, and they did exactly what good players and leaders do. That's exactly what we need from our leaders, and those two guys stepped up big time. Ken, when you, when you say that the things went, the things finally went your way, does that include Connor? You know, missing the open net there. It just doesn't happen all that. Yeah, that well, often. it's you know, those things happening in the game, and I was. The play, the play, he, he, you know, he missed it, and that, that happens. But how about the play he makes later when he, he stays with it in the neutral zone just to get the puck deep? I mean, he's a special player, and I, he's become a special competitor, which is a good sign.